Need some help decorating this season? We can help. Emily Deem is live at Thornberry Cottage and Howard with some great ideas. Hi, Em. Hey, Rachel. Good morning to you. Hi, everybody. Yeah, we're out here at Thornberry Cottage in Howard. Sue Vanden Elzen is here with me this morning. She's had some great tips for your stairways, your stairs, your bathroom, everything pretty much. Now, if you have a fireplace, a mantle, something you want to switch up, we have some great ideas. Sue, why don't we start up here with the mantle? Tell me what you did here. Well, it's nice to use some of the pieces you already have, first of all, not buy everything else new. And it doesn't take a lot. For some really nice lamps, we've made sure that we've got a real low wattage bulb in there and we put just a little bit of the draping over the top, then it doesn't get hot. And that just adds a little bit of effect. Those worked well to do that too. And then a mirror, a lot of people have mirrors above their fireplaces. In this case, we've just tucked in a lightweight, nice bowl with a little bit of shimmer to grab some light and then attach some really friendly mm -hmm. creatures, the kind you like. Yeah, the spiders that aren't so scary. Yeah, and getting some different heights involved up there just for interest and things. And if I could tell anybody to do one thing, it would be get some different heights on the mantle. That's really important to make it interesting. Okay. We're fortunate we have a really deep mantle. A lot of people have narrow ones, but you can still do that. You can still work with maybe upside down bone pole leaves underneath your pieces just to lift some things up in the air to, to help get some height going. This is, you see this in the stores a lot, just some unattractive netting, but when you get to play with it up mm -hmm. on the mantle and up on our lamps, it really does add kind of a neat background. Yeah, it really does. And I like the signs that you have, you know, a cute happy Halloween sign or that owl. Um, speaking of owls, really cute what you did down here by the fireplace. Yeah, we caged this guy. He was a little sassy. But <laughs> it's fun to just add a little tag. The kids get a kick out of that, that, that you know, you enjoy their make-believe as well. But it's a cute, it, it's neutral colors that we've just added some of the pops of orange to. Yeah, definitely. This is something I really like. Tell me about this. It's just made out of felt. They're very inexpensive. Um, they're pretty durable. You can cut them apart to use the spider webs other places. But here it works really nice to just jazz up that stone. And look at you have a wreath inside. This is a new little holder. It's got the wreath holder right behind the lamp. And then we can put our battery operated candle inside. And if you want to if you're without wall space, this is a great way to hang a wreath. This is awesome. Thank you so much, Sue, for really great ideas for people at home. If you want to learn more about Thornberry Cottage, go to our website. We'll send it back to you, Rachel. It's pretty and spooky all at the same time. I love it. Thanks, Em.